Now that breaking news we're following here closely on WSMD4, a man dead after a shooting involving Springfield police officers. WSMD4's Jordan James live in Robertson County right now. Jordan, you just got to that scene. What have you learned at this point? Alexandra, according to our partners at Smokey Bourne News, this started as a report of a robbery and ended with a man being shot and killed. I'm going to step out of the way to give you guys at home a better look at the scene. Right now, we're at the corner of Blair and Cherry Street, and this is that vehicle that investigators say was this, that was stolen from a nearby store not far from here. As you can see, it appears that dozens of rounds were fired into that car, leading to TBI investigators being out here, Springville Police, all of different law enforcement agencies out here collecting evidence as we speak. Um, investigators are still trying to determine um, exactly, you know, what prompted, where was this vehicle stolen from? And there's still a lot of unanswered questions at this point in time. But right now, things are kind of at a standstill as they continue to collect evidence. But once we learn more information, we'll be sure to uh, pass it along. But for now, reporting here in Springfield, Jordan James, WSMB4. Yeah, developing story we're going to follow here closely. Thanks, Jordan. Uh, before that shooting with officers, police were called to investigate another shooting in Springfield. Smokey Bar News reporting that that one happened near 18th Street or 18th East Street, and the person was taken to the hospital. Police are still looking for that suspect.